Argentina back in 1978. I was a student with my Konica TC Reflex in form as before. And uh, since then, many things have changed. And then I came again with HP, uh, the company I'm working with, back in 2006, when we introduced uh, major innovations in large format printing. And then in 2008, in 2010, and then I'm back again in 2012. So I have seen quite a lot of uh, evolution in the photo industry. And I will take you through how we see that industry evolving, the transformation that HP has been doing, and then in the second part of the presentation, David Lesham, uh, the worldwide strategic business director for HP Indigo, will communicate to you the, the news of the day. So the transformation that we have started back uh, in the 2000s is really accelerating, and uh, you will see what we are announcing today so special. So if we look at the, the photo industry, we are going to talk about professional photographers, consumer photographers, but HP, we are focusing primarily on photo finishers and pro labs. So our key customers are, are these ones. We are providing technology to pro labs and photo finishers, and these ones are serving the needs of consumers and professional photographers. So we are not directly talking to consumers. So the market is... Uh, it's changing a lot, and I have done a little bit of uh, history putting everything on one page. So, the photos, they, you know it, huh? you are in that industry every day, so the photos, they have clearly, they have left the, the shoe box. Um, photography is expanding from the traditional exhibitions that were done 20, 30 years ago, where you have beautiful black and white silver highlight. Um, and uh, now it is really, evolving and that evolution HP has been driving it so we, we have been helping the transformation of that industry and the industry has really been evolving from it, it was born as a technique it was indeed invented by a French guy uh, close to Lyon uh, so that evolution of photography that was a technique has migrated to become a science this is where Kodak did indeed quite a lot with many others and then it became a lifestyle and as soon as photography became a lifestyle, everything moving in the cloud today, this is where many things have accelerated. Digital transformation has been very, very heavy in photography. It's probably the most obvious and visible digital transformation together with music. This is the two big examples. And uh, this is where we are today in a world where everything is digital, everything is social, everything is lifestyle and you have photography everywhere. <coughs> so that evolution that started uh, around documentary and memory capture is now really much evolving to lifestyle and artistic creations. 